Hello everyone, uh, I just thought I'd make a video for people having problems with Solid Edge um, in respect to printing out their uh, part uh, on a regular printer at actual size. So if they have like a small part, they can print it out and then just tape it on to a piece of wood or whatever and uh, cut it out easily, easily that way. So in order to do this, first of all we're going to go to our view and select the view we want to print out. Now, a normal piece of paper is 8.5 by 11, so this is uh, going to be within that range. This is 5 inches by 4.312, this particular part here. So, first of all, uh, we don't want to print out this back, uh, this uh, background that's like um, uh, gradient, so we want to, or gradient, however you say it, we want to go to view up here, and we want to click on this view overrides, and then we want to go to background, click on that. Okay, and we want to change uh, gradient to solid edge default. Just click OK. Okay, now that'll change it to a white background. And then all we've got to do is go up to here and go to print. And then we go uh, select, it says print range. We just select print area. Click OK. And then we're, we've got this like, uh, little cursor type thing. We just select what area we want to print out. So I'll say, I'll tell it to print uh, what I can see basically. But you can select anything you want. And then uh, and then uh, to do this correctly you gotta click manual scale right here. And then the paper length is one inch. Design length, you just change that to one inch. So everything is uh, the same scale basically. And that's all you have to do. Just click OK. And then your printer uh, will start printing it out at that current size. It's as simple as that. And we'll just wait here. and It'll say it's going to connect. There it is. It's printing it out. And now you will have a print uh, printout of that part at the exact dimensions that you need to be able to um, put that on a piece of wood and then just cut it out from that, um, uh, you know, cut it out from the paper and then tape it onto the piece of wood and then, you know, make your part from there. Alright, that's it. <laughs>